A new challenge with the new kit. A lot of things change every season, and the only thing that remains the same, Allah has continued striving to clench each and every championship. What makes us always looking forward? It's your mouth when you are watching Al Ahli Online TV English News, getting an in depth view of Al Ahli for this week. So let's start with the headlines. Al Ahli start Egyptian Premier League campaign in style. Qumsan, we still have a long road to go. Abdul Qadir, I did not achieve anything yet with Al Ahli. Al Ahli advanced to CAF Champions League group stage. Al Ahli started the 2021 2022 Egyptian Premier League campaign with a comfortable 4 0 victory over Ismaili at Burgin Arab Stadium. Percy Tau was keen to make his game special as he scored a brilliant race to help the team achieve an important three points in our journey to win the league title. Sami Qumsan, Al Ahli's football first team assistant head coach, spoke following the team's impressive victory against Ismaili on Wednesday, saying, We still have a long road to go. We expect a tough competition as we will be overwhelmed with games. Aside from the fact that all teams will be motivated to win, it was clear that we changed our formation in today's game. Also, we got to see how the new players will blend into the team. Tao, Megisoni, Abdul Qadir, and all the rest of the team put on a good performance tonight. Ahmad Abdul Qadir expressed his happiness after achieving a 4 0 victory over Ismaili, saying, I'm glad to score tonight, but I did not achieve anything yet with Al Ahli. The season is so long, and I'm working on improving my performance in the upcoming period. I'm glad that I implanted Musimani's instructions tonight, even though I participated in the final minutes of the game. I would like to thank my teammates who helped me a lot. The experienced players in the team play an important role in supporting the young and new players. Al Ahli secured qualifications to the CAF Champions League group stage after achieving a comfortable 6-1 victory over Niger's USGN in the second leg of the run of 32, winning the tie 72 on aggregate. Kahraba and Afsha were on a good run of form and helped the Red Eagles book the ticket to the Champions League group stage for the seventh consecutive time. Thanks for watching Al Ahli Online TV English News from Al Ahli Bia Salam Stadium. I'm Yumna Atwa. See you next week.